Hi guys, today I'm going to show you how to connect this sensor to this board. This is a Arduino ASP8266 board. So, let's move on to the wire connection. Okay, this is the wire cable and it's real simple. You do you just connect the power, so the five volt and the ground. The board has the name of this field and on this board you have the name of the field here. So in this project I'm gonna show you how to send the data uh, the data of this sensor through the cloud and send it to ubidots. So let's move to the desktop environment and let's go. So here we are on the desktop environment. So to interpret that uh, that the sensor we return, we use this data sheet. It's really simple to find. You write this on Google, and the first link is this one. So this is the parameter, and we use later. The sensor is this one. I bought from AliExpress for this price, and in ten days I arrived to my own. Mm, I use this library to test uh, if the temperature and humidity sensor work. So the this part of the sensor and for the for this part I use this uh, library one moment yeah this one and I use in particular this example I import to Arduino IDE this one I use. I import obviously this driver. So to import it's very simple. You add the file and you add, you add the, the zip. So so here we are on the code. We use this protocol, it's very common on the IoT project to send the data to ubidots. Ok, the code I post this on github later, in the description you find uh, the link to, to arrive. So, the important part is this. First of all, the name of your Wi-Fi and the password. And this one is the token that you find in uh, Ubidots. You find it here the default token. You copy, you copy, and you post. Post. I don't remember if this one, but it's probably this token. I don't remember. So you connect your board to your PC, and now I connect. One moment. Okay. Okay. So I stop to posting data because the logs rotate. So I need uh, this part of the code. Start from this. So uh, the code if it's comment and it's very really simple to understand. Uh, we use the the sensor in default mode. Sorry, the standard mode, and uh, we do a measurement every 30 minutes uh, because when you do a lot of measurement the sensor heat a lot and uh, the temperature go really high and this is a problem so the output that you see on the serial monitor is this one but this is not necessary when they connect to Wi-Fi he returns the IP address he tried to connect to 
broker <coughs> and this one is the data that sent to um, to ubidos this part of the code is commented because I don't want to send this data to Ubisoft. I was saying um, when you send a lot of dots to the server, the site block you. Uh, you have uh, 4000 dots per day and uh, if you send this data that is not necessary, uh, you, you you arrive to your limits and this is a problem so this part it's a turn here on the serial monitor but it's not sent to uh, ubidots when you send the data you return this so this one and now I'm going to show you how it's on the site okay now the, the sensor is turned off but this is the output so like this and like that and if you want it's possible to uh, show a, like a panel with uh, ah, yeah this dashboard and if you want it's possible to do this kind of uh, graph that's really helpful and this is it this is the code it's very simple mm, I never find online this type of code so I wrote and like subscribe and leave a comment thanks